It comes as the state is seeing an even more infectious from a new, more contagious strain of the coronavirus. The CDC saying Florida now leads the nation in reported cases of this variant. And tonight, state health experts are warning it could worsen the pandemic. News 6's Lauren Cervantes joins us live outside Orlando Health in downtown Orlando with what she's learned. Lauren? Well, according to the CDC, more than a third of cases caused by the COVID variant are here in the state of Florida. Today, I spoke with a professor who tells me this is likely just the tip of the iceberg. The old cockroach in the kitchen analogy. You know, if you see one cockroach, chances are there are hundreds behind the kitchen cabinet. Same thing here. Thomas Unash is the co-director of the Center for Global Health and Infectious Disease Research at the University of South Florida reacting to the latest data that shows Florida leads the country in cases connected to the COVID variant. 46 recorded in Florida, 122 recorded nationwide. Unash says while he's expecting to see case numbers peak no matter what, he says the variant could push the peak even higher. So we may end up peaking at, um, you know, three times the number of cases we have now, 30, uh, maybe 35,000 to 40,000 cases, new cases a day. And it could come very much more quickly because the, uh, the variant is much more contagious. So it's going to spread more quickly. In terms of the new variant. What do you attribute um, Florida having the highest number of cases in the country? What do you attribute that to? I think, um, again, we are still investigating the reasons uh, for that. Uh, but Florida being a, a place where there is a lot of um, people coming from all around the world and um, all around the, the country, uh, it is easier for, for this to happen. And while that investigation continues, UNASH fears cases connected to the variant will continue to go up. We're seeing this peak start to develop, and what we really want to do is try and get through this peak and get to the point where we can vaccinate everybody before this new vir uh, variant can really take hold and really start to explode our case numbers. Dr. Crespo tells me that both vaccines are effective against the new variant. In Orlando, I'm Lauren Cervantes, getting results, News 6.